Well, hello, and welcome to Psychic Ravings Readings, Psychic Readings by Pearl. Are you ready to revisit the extraordinary psychic perceptions of Pearl to Wisdom? <laughs> of course you are. Well, Pearl may not be the only dead squirrel on the planet, but she is certainly the most savvy. Uh, for example, have you ever had a sneaking suspicion that in a former life you were Cleopatra? Or Napoleon? Well, the omniscient pearl is here to tell you that you weren't. So forget it. Really, let it go. But you were something. Unless, of course, you're a brand new soul, in which case you were nothing. You know who you are. And if you don't, Pearl does. And she has graciously consented to channel her wisdom through me, Georgette giving some lucky entity a stirring present and past life reading. These one-of-a-kind dazzling readings will be brought to you at the dizzying rate of... Well, we don't really know yet. All right. Now, you'll recall that our first guests were the Apples, the only one of whom has returned to give a testimonial. Are you ready, Apple? All right. This was truly the most enlightening experience of this or any of my lives. Thank you very much. And thank you, Apple. I know we'll be seeing more of her, don't you? <laughs> All right. Now, please help me to welcome today's guest, Emma Meyer Horn. Welcome! Oh, I hasten to assure you that this is a consultation bowl only. We may not be fish people, but we do know that the vast majority of fish belong in bigger bodies of water. So if you see one there, leave it there. If you come across an ill-injured or orphaned fish, contact a professional ichthyologist immediately. If after all this you're still left with a fish, well, you put that little ichthy into a consultation bowl and take it for a psychic ranting reading, a psychic reading by Pearl. All right. Now, I relax and let the great and powerful Pearl take over my mind. Okay. Sure. There it is. Well, are you ready, Pearl? Now, usually I hold the hand of my querents, that's a questioner. But in this case, well, we'll have to make allowances. Yes. You have chosen to return in fish form repeatedly. How's that working out for you? All right. Ah, I see an image. It is you in the south coast of the Mediterranean. Oh, you are so happy in school. You are a cheerful little anchovy. Mm. Ooh, 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 taste. Ooh, mm. Shake it off. Shake it off. Shake it off. Oh, here you are, draped in green robes, reclining on a bed of... Oh, wait. Those aren't green robes. That's a grape leaf. You're the main course in a sushi bar. Shake it off. Shake it off. Shake it all off. Okay, listen up. Beware of shiny things like hooks and safety pins and lures and yellow slippers. Beware of nets and spears and poison darts and dynamite and male bonding. What you need is this 
obsidian pendant to ward off evil. Only $69.99. All right. Now, I'm going to place this around your neck. I, I know it's it seems heavy at first, but just until your neck muscles build up a bit. All right. All I can do is recommend. Now, have you a final question for the future past and present pearl? No, dear. You are not Moby Dick. Uh, uh, not Jaws, no. Flipper, Willy, Nemo, no. Who's Ogopogo? No, dear. No, you were not the Loch Ness Monster. Not even the Candy Graham Delivery Shark. Oh, but darling, what you need to realize, what we all need to realize, is the most important thing is finding the joy in, that's right, now. All right. So, people, you who share your life with a companion fish, please, Give it a life worth living. All right. For example, let's not deny it tradition. And, of course, we always like healthy green things. And how about a seal for that sense of security? And we have for that all-important sense of community, friends. Be very careful when introducing friends. I thought we had more friends when we started. Apple? How could you? <laughs> well, they're going to be needing some past life therapy along the line, aren't they? And that's what Pearl is for. All right. Now, we conclude with Pearl's takeaway message just for you. Reminding you to address the elephant in your living room. Until next time, bye. Bye-bye. I am so mad at you. What? Oh, not now.